Hello, Kula here. I hope you guys are having a great weekend. It's been nice and sunny here, so it's been very uplifting uh, compared to the last week or so where it's been gloomy. It is still unfortunately chilly. I hear it's going to be kind of a long, hard winter this year, so I'm, you know, not looking forward to that. But if the sun's out, things are generally okay. Uh, as you can probably guess, I have something here to show you that I recently bought. Uh, I did just do a video of things I bought, um, but this was kind of... I bought afterwards. I got this yesterday. Um, what had happened was I had gone shopping on Thursday because I needed to pick up a dress uh, for a wedding that we had to go to this weekend. And also some, you know, essential stuff like the makeup remover and the brush cleaner and I had to use a coupon and things like that. And I saw this item when I was shopping on Thursday, but I didn't pick it up because I was trying to save money. I was, I kind of rationalized my way out of it, and I thought I was being good, and you know, I didn't buy it and everything. But then when I got home, like I thought about it some more, and I get the feeling that this is going to be something that's pretty popular. Um, it's it's going to be something that might be kind of hard to find. Um, so. As you all know, if you do shop at Sephora, JC Penney's now have Sephora's in them. And when they first started doing that, I thought that was kind of weird. Like, why would you put a Sephora in a JC Penney when there's a big Sephora just down the hall? I know for some, like, a lot of places, like, you know, where my mom lives, they don't have a Sephora, they just have a JC Penney. So it's actually really nice to have the Sephora little pop up thing in the JC Penney. Uh, but for, like, in my mall, like I said, like, there's the JCPenney, and then, like, literally just down the hall, there's the big Sephora. But I've actually really grown to like the fact that there's those two Sephoras, because if something is sold out at the big Sephora, then sometimes it's in stock in the little Sephora in JCPenney. And I've noticed that the Sephora in JCPenney tends to have different sales as well. Um, they'll have different items on sale, they'll have different sale prices even sometimes. Like, I've noticed, like... Some products I've picked up on sale at the JCPenney Sephora is just still full price in the regular Sephora or online. So it's it's kind of a nice way to, I guess, take advantage of there being two Sephoras and being kind of two different stores. And what's nice is that, you know, your points work, you can use your Beauty Insider card. It, it's just like a Sephora, it's just in JCPenney. Although, like, with this purchase, it hasn't gone on to my account yet. Like, when I bought it, she told me my updated points total. But when I went online to check, it didn't update it, so I don't know if that's just a weekend thing. It kind of makes me a little nervous, but, you know, if it doesn't go up, maybe I'll just email them. But anyways, <laughs> so this product, it's an exclusive to the JCPenney and Sephora, so I don't think this is something you can find online. I don't think this is something you can buy online. I think this is a product that you have to go to a Sephora and JCPenney to get. So, now that I've kind of hyped it up, let me show you what I got. I've actually been really excited. I haven't opened this yet because I really wanted to do a first impression with you guys. So, I got the Lip Service Lip Sampler. And this is the Sephora Inside JCPenney exclusive. This was $28. Um, they had a lash one, you know, a mascara one, and they had an eyeliner one as well. They're all $28. And... What makes this really cool is that, so like every year around this time of year, Sephora releases their like Sephora favorites section, yes, these are the Sephora favorites collections, and they do, you know, fragrance collections, they'll do a lip collection, they do a mascara collection generally, I think they always have an eyeliner one as well, and then they'll have a couple collections where it's kind of like just a bunch of different products, like I think the one it's like, Sephora's favorites is like this one it's full of like their favorite products and then there's a glitz and glam one which is like party kind of supplies so regular Sephora has the give me some lip set and then they give me some more lip sets and I was interested in getting one of those but then I saw this and then what really drew me to this one was that it had an OCC lip tar and it had the Smashbox uh, lipstick in it so the one that Sephora has that's kind of around the same price point is their Give Me Some Lip and it's $25 and it's a $90 value and has six products and it has like pinks and nudes. And that one includes the Laura Mercier Lip Glacé in Bare Pink, the Buxom Full on Lip Polish in Dolly, Nars's Lip Gloss in Turkish Delight, the Fresh Sugar Rose Tinted Lip Treatment, Bite Beauty High Pigment Pencil in Rhubarb, and the Tarte Lip Surgeon's Lip Luster in Glitzy, which is the one full-size product in that set. Um, 
that one didn't really intrigue me. I, I've used a lot of those products before. Um, so I, I wasn't interested in that. I was interested though in the Give Me Some More Lip because it has some really interesting stuff in it including uh, an OCC lip tire which is something I've been really wanting to try. So in the Give Me Some More Lip, it's the $59 and it's a $209 value. It has 16 products and that has the Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie Lipstick in Never Say Never, which is a full size, the Bite Beauty High Pigment Pencil in Pomegranate, Buxom Full Body Lipstick and Lip Cream in Menace and White Russian respectively, Hourglass Opaque, Ro Opaque Rouge Liquid Lipstick in Icon, Kat Von D in Everlasting Love Liquid Lipstick in Backstage Bambi, uh, Kat Von D for Love Lipstick in Adora, the Laura Mercier Lip Glacé in Bare Naked, Makeup Forever uh, Rouge Artist Natural N45, OCC Lip Tar and Strumpet, which is a full size in that kit, uh, the Smashbox Be Legendary Lipstick in Nylon Nude, which is a full size in that kit, uh, Smashbox Lip Gloss in Pout, Stila Color Bomb Lipstick in Sonia, the Stila Stay, Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lip Color in Dolce, Tarte Glamazon Pure Performance 12-Hour Lipstick in Inspired, and the Too Faced La Creme Color Drenched Lip Cream in Marshmallow Bunny, which is a full size. There's a lot of really sweet products in that one, but at $59 just for lip products, it was a little out of my budget. But when I saw this, this is kind of like an in-between. It has products that are in the Give Me Some More Lip, which I was really interested in. I think it has two or three that are the same, like it has, this Tarte is the same, uh, the Smashbox is the same, uh, the Bite Beauty is the same as the Give Me Some Lip one, it's just a different, nope, no, the Bite Beauty is the same as in the Give Me Some More Lip one, it's the same color because it's rhubarb in the smaller one, and I think it has the tar, but it's a different color in this box. So I thought this is a really happy medium, like at $28 it has the products I was interested in in the Give Me Some More Lip box. But it wasn't as expensive. And as you can see, um, I got the last one. I went uh, Saturday morning because I just I couldn't stop thinking about it. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is this is gonna be something that's gonna be hard to get. I have to get this. So I got the last one. So I mean it is a little marked up here. Uh, but it is still sealed. And I was waiting to unseal it so I could share it with you guys. So let's unseal this now and hopefully this won't take me forever. One second. So this is, as you can see, uh, $28 and it has two full sizes, which I believe is the Stila Lip Glaze in here and the Smashbox Lipstick. Here, this end will open better. Okay. I have to do both sides. I am so sorry. I should have done this before. I didn't think. too it has like it's like laser cut out that's pretty so this is the box here very pretty rose gold and then these are the products inside so in this kit uh, you get the bite beauty high pigment pencil in pomegranate the buxom full-on lip cream in cure royale the OCC lip tar in pretty boy the smashbox be legendary lipstick in nylon nude the Stila Lip Glaze in Apricot, and the Tarte Glamazon Pure Performance 12-Hour Lipstick in Inspired. Oh, so that's those products there. Um, so super excited about getting this. Um, I'm kind of trying to maybe move away from glosses. I tend to prefer glosses. Um, but color-wise, like I just, I don't know, like I've, I've been more interested in maybe trying out some more lipsticks. I think it's because I've been getting so many lipsticks in my subscription boxes. Uh, but let's just kind of swatch some of these for you guys. So this is one of the full sizes. This is the Smashbox Lipstick in Nylon Nude. And then this is uh, the same one that was in the Give Me Some More Lip box. So this is just kind of like just a really pretty nude color. You can swatch them. We'll put it here. So it's like a peachy, a peachy nude. So that's that one there. And this is the Buxom Full On Lip Cream in Cure Royale. Oh, I'm so excited. I wanted to swatch these so bad, but I wanted to wait to show you guys my first impressions. Ooh, that's pretty. So there's that one there. 
It's kind of more plummy, a little bit more on the red side. Uh, let's see, then we have the Tarte uh, Glamazon Pure Performance 12 Hour Lipstick in Inspired. And this is the same one that's in the um, Give Me Some More Lip as well. Yeah, this little guy twists up here. Teeny little guy. Let's see. It's kind of more of a cooler pinky color. These are all really nice products, too. They all feel really nice on the skin. And then we have the Bite Beauty uh, High Pigment Pencil in Pomegranate. There we go. This is a twist. That's nice. This looks really red. Oh, that's super creamy. Super creamy, super red. And then the Stila Lip Glaze in Apricot. Oh, so it might take a while. This is one of those turned ones. Pull this guy out. One second. Let me just turn this up. I have a lot of the Stila Lip Glazes. Um, because I got the $25 holiday pack last year. Um, they're nice, but I'm getting bored of them. So I'm not sure how I feel about like a full size of this. So that's just kind of like a really sheer peachy. I think they'd be really pretty over that nylon lipstick. So that's nice there. Just kind of a really sheer, just really peachy kind of color. Smells good too. Steel is always Steel always has really like nice smelling lip glazes. And then finally, the thing that I was almost the most excited about is going to be the OCC Lip Tar. I've seen these on YouTube quite a bit. I've been interested in trying them out. Uh, this was in Pretty Boy, right? Yes, this is in Pretty Boy. The one in the other kit is in Strumpet. And it comes with a little brush too, which is really awesome. It even says Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics in the little brush. That was another thing I really wanted. Um, I kind of wanted to get like the mini kit because they have a special like $20 mini kit now because I'm not sure if I'd ever go through an entire one of these but so that's just a little dollop of it there ooh that is really pigmented look how pink that is not sure if I'll be able to wear that ever but that is really pretty so those are my six new little lip products I'm super excited like Oh, this is this is so nice. Like I'm really happy I bought this for thirty dollars. Like this is definitely worth it. Like it's there. It's a great way to try new and different products. It's it's. I, I really can't recommend these kinds of things enough. Like like I said, like you get six products. You get the little brush with the OCC lip tar, and the fact that this is like an exclusive to the JC Penny. Um, JCPenney Sephora is like, if you see this, like, I, I would say get this. Like, if you're interested in this at all and you see it in stock, get it. Because I can see this definitely being, like, a really popular Christmas gift. You know, at $28, it's, like, $29.99 with tax, here at least. It, this is a great set. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and that you have a great day. Thank you.